seems this is the year of um, Toby and Esebume. Tell us um, so far so good about this wonderful girl since um, the uh, World Championship to come our games to just have yesterday and the Diamond League ever for Esebume. Tell us about the exploit so far so good. Oh, 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 oh. Like you said, it's been a very great year um, for, for the two girls, Toby Amushon and Esebume. Um, from the African Championship, actually, um, to the Commonwealth Games, to the World Championships and the Commonwealth Games, um, it's been blistering performance from the two. Um, for those that know the two very well, you know that they are best of friends, and it's showing on the pitch. Um, the same way um, Amusha is getting the result in the others, Brume is getting um, the results when it comes to the long term event. And like we used to call Pumi in the athletic circles, we call her the medals mag magnet. Um, she has she has that aura around her that any major event that she takes part, she always makes it to the podium. And one one um, cap that was missing before now um, was the Diamond League, and which finally she has broken that chance and she has a Diamond League um, win for herself. And so. It's, it's very, it's very, very um, correct to say that 2022 has been a year for the two girls. Um, we hope um, they can continue in this light. Uh, we all know that the World Championship is next year already. Uh, we don't have to wait for too long to see them at the World Championship again. And so we hope that this can continue. Uh, they can continue in this um, trajectory and have them for long at the top. Yeah, let me ask you, why so long? Or is it the right time of uh, the peak of the career, because a long time we've expected more from these ladies. Some years back, um, all they could do was to win national championship and also African meets and Sino African meets. This year, last year, seems to be the year. Why, why this year? Have there been more um, effort placed on them, or they've added, they did more than expected for themselves? I think it's about time and, and continuous hard work. Um, like they say, Rome wasn't beat in a day. Um, so these girls, they paid their dues. Um, they started from the scratch and here at the top. Um, I can remember Tobi Anushan back then at the um, African Youth Games um, early in Warri. That was the first edition. The little girl we saw then um, running the sprint. And so you wouldn't expect that um, they start one year and the next year they're already um, winning races. And before now, like you said, um, the, it's, it's progression. They first started by conquering the African continent. Um, from there, they went on to the Commonwealth Games. And before you know it, um, the World Championship. And now um, they are doing big things in the, um, in the, in the, in the Diamond League. Um, for Brumi, Brumi, both Brumi and um, um, Amusho, before Birmingham, I already won the Commonwealth Games, so it wasn't that they just um, they just busted into the limelight. And before now, they, before they are experts in Mauritius, they already won the African Championship. Uh, but right now, they are not just seen as continental champions; they are seen as international stars, um, competing with the very best um, around the world. Like I said, they paid their dues, and it just shows that they've remained consistent to hard work. And that hard work, the result is what we are seeing now. Um, we hope that with more support coming their way, they will be able to, like I say, getting to the top is hard, but staying at the top is even harder. So now they've really find their way to the top. We just hope that they can stay at that top for a very long time to come.